Right, this is the track. We just came up through the scrub on the bypass track, which was a lot better. This is this track's the main track has become a water course, I think. It's a bit impassable. And then it goes on up through here. All standing in it to give you some scale. Just for the fun of it. Yep. Well, that's your four wheel drivers. And then it goes on up there. Once we would get going, you'll see it's much easier. And that's that's the track ahead. Away it goes. And it's uh, back to the driving on the tuff. Wow, we've come 720k. Everybody's got their little bit to, to say. And that's a continue on there. That goes on to the old the old gun barrel highway. We're going down the Heather Highway, down to the Warburton Road which we went on in 968 and it's one of these tracks oh it's not actually a gum boot 126 down to lunch this is the, oh, the highway now Hold it up. Bill says I'll get more. Track this of the bonnet. Oh, good. The bonnet keeps coming up. Smooth side track. The nice bit. We'll go up the side here. That's the fastest we've been since what? 
for the whole oh, track. For the whole track yeah, since the um oh for this track, yeah. Since, the gun barrel. since before the gun barrel. Yeah, the since the Wongawal Road. And that's one of the five uh, twenty gallon drums that we had under our bed in the combi when we did the gun barrel and the Warburton Road in sixty eight. There's one on the heather. Very succulent little mm. plants. They're big plants, they're gorgeous. Oh, looks like I trod on one. Oh, sorry little flower. Bush. Anyway. Oh, it's not a sand dune, it's a very stony ridge. There's a very rough section across that plain down there with lots of detours and half a metre deep ruts on the main road. We've seen thousands of camel tracks on the gun barrel, but only one camel on the road. Just came through a section of deep gravel that was like driving a speedboat. Dropped and rolled and carried on. Now we're into the corrugations again. somewhere here and on top of the hill and there's the tower we just saw there's a oh there's another tower over there too yeah, it's not a tower yeah. it's a tower down a spoon drain for a, a spot to get off the road to have lunch. There's nothing after the gun barrel. And we had lunch back there. We're seven from Steptoe's Corner, which is on the Warburton Road. Kim and Vanita are down there now I'd say. We just stopped for a, put some a jerry can in on the Heather Highway. It goes like this all the way around. Well that's 102 down there to 100. The Chuckalurley. Chakali. And this is the the Great Warburton Road which we drove up in the combi along. The huge four lane highway now. There it goes up to Warburton and we'll be there this afternoon. And now we meet our first traffic coming behind me. What 
happens to Jeeps. The drive a bit fast. There's a roof rack. Five pans. Hi, this has been uh, McJume from the Shire of Luna. Offices. We're looking for the art gallery. Yeah. Oh, Rick was here on the. What was it? The third. Yeah. Well, he only got to Bathurst last night. Did he? Yeah. I got a SMS from them on the sat phone. This is the back view of the caravan park at Warburton. We met the, the local guys, had a chat overnight about rolled over Cherokee, Grand Cherokees and rolled over Ultimate Trailers. And that was the guy who patrols the, the night sky with his big torch and he's got a dark companion and he found his land cruiser a twin headlight cruiser in the tip put a new diff in it put some diesel in it and away she went and that's the art gallery we wandered around for an hour or so took lots of photos the artworks and the very expensive not very good coolermans and warmers and things I'll have to show you ours. I don't know how much it costs to build it. Some of the local lads out wandering around outside our enclosure. We're all fenced in here in the Donga with all the cabins with surveyors and whalens, what might whale and the wreckers. It's 229k, I think, to Giles. 
This is the police station. There's nobody around. head off down the rest of the highway to Great Central Road. Two hundred and twenty nine I think it is to the Giles. And a few corrugations and that's about it. One of the local cars, they drive around sedans, a few late model sedans. Here's a couple of raptors just waiting to pounce on all the finches in this gully over here. The gully full of finches just a kilometre out of Warburton. It's a little dip in the road here. Lots of regen on the creek. All the river red gum is sprouting just along the flood level and seeds washed down. It must be called Warburton Creek. There's the, the swing. Every rock hole has its swing. There's the high water mark up there. About 10 feet above our heads. Just, just coming through the Warburton Ranges. It's quite nice back over our shoulders there. Here's the road ahead. Changes from the Road. It's very smooth. 